The wife of Canadian Prime Minister Justin Trudeau tests positive for the new coronavirus, his office says late Thursday, March 12. The Prime Minister is in good health with no symptoms but will still remain in isolation as a precautionary measure. In Brazil, the chief spokesman for the government also tests positive for the coronavirus. The communications chief met United States President Donald Trump last weekend in Florida with Brazilian President Jair Bolsonaro. Trump in a statement says he is not concerned. Meanwhile, a Filipino diplomat at the Philippines' permanent mission to the United States tests positive for COVID-19, but the Foreign Affairs Department assures that necessary health and safety protocols are being implemented. This is the first known coronavirus case at the UN in New York. The World Health Organization says the coronavirus outbreak is a controllable pandemic if countries find and isolate as many cases as possible and quarantine their closest contacts. Meanwhile, South Korea, once the largest coronavirus outbreak site outside China, reports its lowest number of new cases for three weeks. China also reports its fewest new coronavirus cases on record, just eight cases as reported with no new domestic infections outside Hubei province. In Singapore, Prime Minister Li Xianlong rules out a lockdown of the city-state Thursday, March 12. What we are doing now is to plan ahead for some of these more stringent measures try them out and prepare Singaporeans for when we actually need to implement them. We will have to tighten up further, temporarily, though we cannot completely shut ourselves off from the world. As of Friday, March 13, there are 133,900 confirmed cases and 4,900 deaths due to the novel coronavirus cases around the world.